in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Holy words, long preserved for our walk in this world. They resound. For our goodnight message on this Sunday, the 5th of February 2023, broadcasting from the Salesian community of the Sacred Heart in Lusaka, Zambia, by your servant, Father Eustace Siame, a Salesian of Don Bosco, we listen to this encouraging and strengthening message in line with the Word of God for today, entitled, Being Light and Salt of the earth. Today we read from Matthew chapter 5, verse 13 to 16. It was a sermon on the mount. After giving the Beatitudes, Jesus wanting to tell his disciples something more over how their own following him was going to be different from what had happened before, he let them understand that they are the salt and light of the world. God calls us to be salt and light Christians in a bland, dark society. We need to remember salt must not lose its taste and light must not be hidden. As we go to bed tonight, I would like to bring to your attention three statements that declare and describe how to fulfill this role as light and salt of the earth. First, you have to declare that you are different. You should not become like the world. We must guard against being sucked into the prevailing culture and conforming to society's expectations. We are different, and that is clear. Secondly, we are responsible. Feel it within yourself that you are responsible. Every once in a while, we need to ask some hard questions. Are we making contact with others? Are we seeking isolation? It's up to us to spread the salt and light. There is no way we are going to change our world today if we isolate ourselves from the world. The Bible tells us, You are not of this world, but you are in this world. John chapter 15 verse 19. And being not of this world shows that we are different. And being in this world shows that we are to be responsible. We are going to be answerable to God how we became our brother's keeper. And then thirdly, you are influential. We are influential. I am influential. Let's not kid ourselves. The very fact that we belong to Christ, that we don't adopt to the system, that we march to a different drumbeat, gives us an influence in this society of ours. We are influencing others in our every behavior, be it good or bad. Even when we aren't trying, out comes the sword and on comes the light. Remember to keep your light on and your salt shaker tipped. Christians must avoid isolation and always be in contact with others. It's up to us to spread salt and light. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may Almighty God bless you, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Good night, as it dreams. Same to you, Father. It's your word.